The next location will be the crematorium over here. Back to the main case. This district does look a little bit different though, in comparison to the other places. Maybe back when the city was nice, it's the entertainment area. Oh! What's this? I'm not at the crematorium yet. I just randomly saw this house. Or this is a grocery store. It's way too quiet. Whoa, that is demonic. That's demonic. There is something going on here. No. Again with the coil spring problem. Maybe this means we should just use the first aid kit. It's nice to have full health anyway, in case if that big guy tries to attack me. Oh, because I didn't craft it yet. Here we go. What? Why is it glowing like that? These are dead bodies, right? Whoa. Is that the slime that Carpenter said he was covered in when he woke up? Ooh. Where even are we? We didn't get a location marked here. It's a random house. People have probably already taken all the money in the cashier, ransacked the whole place, but no! <laughs> the entire store is still completely stocked. Really? But then again, remember how they said money doesn't mean anything here anymore. Supply is king. And I'm full on supplies. Guess the store owner sleeps here. Do I really not have room for this? I really don't. Well, what a strange little store. It's pretty much completely intact, but there's nothing we can do here. As far as I can see. A weird little document thing, a lot of supplies, and some weird dead bodies down there that are kind of glowing, but... Okay. Okay. Maybe it's for a side case or we come back here later on. Something like that. What the heck is that? City Archive. Somebody defending somebody else. Crematorium should be in the water here. Does that mean that nobody can be cremated? What are you all doing with the dead bodies anyway? Haven't really seen any lying around. Wait, they probably put it into that house that we were just at. That place definitely seemed a little bit weird. Ooh! There was demonic signage on the walls. Can't trust that. Okay, where's the dang crematorium around here? Here? Oh! This thing! I was so focused on the intersection, I didn't consider this plot of land here. So the thing about the crematorium is that... What did Brutus say about this? He woke up here, naked. But did he say he met a church, he met a priest at an old church or something? 
I don't think that's a location though. Not yet anyway. Hmm. Office, funeral hall, morgue, crematorium. Orally Ludot. Come on, dude. Fuck it, man. Let's go bowling. What? Weird Easter egg. You know, during plague times, would the crematorium be making more money because more people are dying? Or would they be making less money because less people care about this kind of thing? Because everybody's dying. Hello? Oh my god. I don't like this. Crematorium registry last week. Person on duty, James Warren. List of deceased. Unidentified people. J. Huss S. Cole V. Black, Jack White. To be cremated urgently. So James Warren might know more about this? This week, person on duty, Robert Taylor, because James Warden Warren has been on sick leave since last week. That's a clue. How do we find this Mr. James Warren? You know, for a place like this, you would expect it to be crawling with clues that I can see with my mind's eye, but no. Note on the door. I locked up and left early today. The keys are on the table. P.S. This morning I heard wild beasts near the cemetery. Be careful. Well, the keys are on the table. Oh my god. The slime! It is the same slime. Ugh, what a stench. Why is it moving like that? Okay, you better not freak me out. Or I'll kill you. Funeral hall is the same place as the crematorium. It's all in one service. Whoever held this poker has got to be covered in slime. Hmm. Would they still be here? I'm so scared that everything in their mother is gonna wake up suddenly. Someone tried to wash the stain out, but it's still slimy. Ugh, and stinks. But that's it. The guy locked up and left early today. Ugh, it reeks to high heaven. What is this stuff? I don't know, you tell me. Scary Cthulhu slime. Well, we're still not done, so we must be missing something. Oh, this thing had another point! And judging by the dried blood and the dent on this shovel, it was used as a weapon. Okay. Oh! That was the last thing we were missing. You... hit somebody. By this time, though, I feel like Brutus Carpenter should already be fainted because he wouldn't come here on his own, right? What by the angles is going on? Where... where am I? That's him waking up at the end. Uh, 
I need to get out of here before he comes round. Oh, then the previous one wasn't the end, then. Ah, another one for you. Burn him first chance you get. It's urgent. Let's get a handle on what actually happened here. Hey, who's the guy who said that? Ah, another one for you. Burn him first chance you get. Oh. It's urgent. Wait. And then... Actually, this doesn't make sense to me, because by the time he arrived here, yeah, like I said, he should be fainted already, right? What by the angles oh. is going on? Where... where am I? This is two. What by the angles is going on? Where... where am I? He wakes up, whacks the guy here, and leaves. Uh, I need to get out of here before he comes round. Brutus was brought in by some group who had to deal with the crematorium worker. So, Brutus woke up, knocked the guy out cold, and escaped. And we got everything here, didn't we? Mine palace clue? Brutus stunned the crematorium worker. Crematorium shift schedule. The guy he stunned is James Warren. Locate James Warren. I need to talk to James Warren, the man who was on shift when Brutus woke up. He's suffering from a head injury and requires urgent treatment. The hospital. Okay. Can I do anything else here? Graham's motivated to change things. Graham's brave enough to go against the family's traditions. He really wants to change things for better. Yo, they're gonna make me choose between Brutus and Graham here. Well, I suppose it is time to head back to the hospital then, huh? The hospital was... all the way here. Since we're coming back here anyway, I think we should go to the police department because, for the other case, the Gondro Dim one, we have a search warrant that we might be able to look up at the station. We are at the police archive. My evidence is the search warrant. Oh, is that icon a hint that we can do something with this? Cool. Crimes. Complaints of suspicious activity. Complaints. Subjects. Suspects. We're trying to find Gondra Randall right now, right? Well, we're really trying to find Bethany, but I don't think we can find her like this. Evidence. None. District. Salvation Harbor. Dang! Gaunter Randall, alias David Miles, mirror maker, sex male, age unknown. Residents fled the city. Last known location, Oakmont, Mass. Northern Old Grove, the corner of Windhaf Avenue and Gold Bridge Road. Suspected of disrupting public order, subversive behavior, counterfeiting. So I can go ahead and put this on my map then. Because we know where he is now. Yeah. Right over here. Whenever we get back to Throngmorn for reporting, we can go visit that again. But for now, let's head off to the hospital. Oh? Historical Heritage Hospital of St. Mary, founded 1862. Designed by B.A. Kaplan. Every life matters. We just got an entire case off picking something up? The flood took something from us all, but can we afford to let it take from our city? Countless historic sites have been damaged, some beyond repair, and it is our duty to preserve what's left of them. This brochure will tell you about our oldest, proudest sites, including the Church of Redemption, the Church of St. Michael, blah 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 blah. Oh, it's about like... restoration? So they're giving me a whole bunch of locations here. Uh, I'll pass on this for now. What? I'll send whatever help I can, but there's no room here. We have our hands full. What's your problem? <laughs> I can still interact with people in the real life, even though I'm in this mode. This way. Stay by the fire while I try to find you some medicine. New victims. 
And if the flood won't relent, there'll be even more. Time to figure this out. Well, they're trying to bring them all to the hospital. No victims. And if the flood won't relent... This way. Stay by the fire while I try to find you some medicine. I'll send whatever help I can, but there's no room here. We have our hands full. The flood was sudden and hit the city hard. The hospital staff tried to help, but quickly ran out of room and medicine. We know this is a lie, alright? They have so many empty beds here. Be safe. We don't have any free beds left. <laughs> You're a goddamn liar. <laughs> okay. James Warren. Oh, frick! Wait! Was that the guy? The other victim that was here? Because we met two people here previously, right? One was the captain, and then the other is James Warren. Scratch me. Please, please, just here. This itching is driving me insane. There's new victims here. And a doctor. They got a new one, because Cavendish... Did he even lose his job? I don't know. Actually, I thought he would be here, but... No. Oh, my stomach. I ain't never eaten leeches ever again, no sir. He should not be doing that to begin with. No, we can't break this. Okay, then maybe we just came here for the archive after all. Because we gotta find his place of residence. So maybe he's been discharged already. Um, yeah, locate James Warren. Subjects, patients, period, after the flood. Department would be... Well, therapy? Male, 35, place of work, crematorium. Diagnosis, head trauma, concussion, treatment, hospitalized, second floor of Oakmont St. Mary Hospital. Bed rest recommended. Yes. Be safe. We don't have any free beds left. <laughs> I thought he wasn't here, though. Are you kidding me? He doesn't spawn until you find the freaking archive thing. <laughs> You're James Warren, right? Hey, that's me. What do you want? I'm sick, can't you see? A week ago, a group of people brought an unconscious man to the crematorium. I need to know who those people were. What makes you think I'd know that? You got hurt that day. That's why you're in the hospital. The man you were supposed to burn knocked you out and escaped. Horse feathers. I hit my head. Fell down the stairs. I'm trying to keep it a secret. You were supposed to cremate a man listed as Jack White. He escaped, and now he wants to know what's going on. So tell me. Who paid you to burn a man alive? How do you know about White? I talked to him. I need names, Warren. Uh, I can't. <laughs> I say anything. I'm toast. They'll certainly kill you if they find out Jack White is still alive. I can arrange that. No, please. No, I, I didn't ask their names. They're priests, but they ain't from St. Michael's Church, that's for sure. They were talking about the Lord of the Woods or something. Maybe from an old Oakmont church? That's all I know, I swear. Where can I find this church? I don't know. Some things in this borg are best left alone. I'll have to figure it out myself. It's not much, but thanks. Wasn't that hard after all, was it? You got what you came for. Now leave me be. Bye. We did get something. It's not much, but this might line up with the whole Brutus supposed to be meeting a church, or a priest at a church. Church goers wanted Brutus to be cremated. Find an old Oakmont church. All evidence leads to an old Oakmont church that worships the Lord of the Woods. Maybe some history books could shed light on which church it is. History books. History books would be... University library? 
Okay, makes sense. But I wonder if the side case here... Because it's got a few locations, right? Oh, what do you want me to do here? Oh, maybe doing the actual that investigation one, two, three thing. That's all we need to do for this side quest? Because this is the only one that doesn't have a thing anymore. This brochure will tell you about our oldest, proudest sites. Because I'm wondering here, there are a few churches in this place. In the fish market. The university. Oh, maybe that's what it is. All we gotta do is go near it. Okay. Right now, I think we should be heading off to the university library. Uh... Hello? Hello. Welcome to Oak Mountain oh my University God. Library. Joy Hayden, can I help? Uh, Charles Reed, private investigator. What's... what's wrong with you? I apologize for my bluntness, but can I ask you a question? Mouth? Yeah. Punishment. Long story. Again, sorry for me being so direct, but that can't be legal, can it? This looks like... it looks like torture. Legal in Oakmont. Local custom. Huh. Uh, is this what Lovecraftian mythology is all about? All this weird stuff here. I need to see your book catalogs. Sure. Over there. And that's it? No payment, no threatening, no favors in return? No. Library public. Knowledge for everyone. Welcome. Well, that's music to my, uh, eyes. This city doesn't look like it has much need for books, except as fuel for fires. How come the library is in such good shape? Mr. Throgmorton. Funds. Keeps everything in check. Really? Huh. I wouldn't have thought that of him. I wonder why. Because he, he seems like an ass. People need hope. Entertainment. Escapism. Now more than ever. Can't imagine library without his help. Bye, Joy. Of all the methods of entertainment, he chooses to save the library. Not a horrible thing, I suppose. Staff only. Well, I guess I'm staff now. Not that there is really anything here. Just leads me straight back to the archive. Okay, no, 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 not this case. The main case. Give me a church. Religion? Book information. Um... Author? N no book information, how about? Period. Mm. Depends on how old the church is, right? Ancient or old Oakmont church that worships the Lord of the Woods. It could be ancient. Region, local. Okay, maybe it's 17th to 19th century. Prayer to the heavens. Another prominent Oakmont place of worship was the Redemption Church. Its flock venerated Kay as the Lord of the Woods, the shepherd of the Lost Lambs. Redemption Church was at one time the city's largest congregation, but its influence dwindled after St. Michael's Church of the Burning Bush was founded. Redemption Church still stands in Central Salvation Harbor on Marsh Avenue between Polaris Road and Old Church Road. Now, out of curiosity, could we also find the location of the other church for the historical heritage sites? Religion? Maybe not. Yeah. Okay, yeah, because they, they don't have an icon here, and they expect me to just kind of come across these places, I think. Prayer to the heavens. Marsh Avenue between Polaris Road and Old Church Road. And we're looking for a church today here. This should be pretty noticeable, right? Because I'm expecting it to look like... No thank you, I'm not gonna be going in there today. Is it this? Church of Redemption.
Church of Redemption, founded in 1667. Cast away from your evil deeds and find redemption in our Lord. Two competing churches in the same place. <sighs> the door won't budge. Oh, we can fix that. <laughs> Am I not hitting it right? <laughs> can I not hit that, or... Maybe I'll just use these bullets since I never use them anyway. There we go. I just broke open their door forcefully. Am I still going to be welcome here? Or am I going to hell? Note from the church. Hilda failed to seduce the mayor with promises of eternal life. Now we need some mercury spilled in his bedroom to make our proposals more attractive. Ooh. Did they kill the mayor? Oh my god. Oh, lord, what have I done? No, 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 no. It's fake. It's fake. Or oh, no, it's not. It's actually not. Freaking use a fire bomb or something. One of them's dead. Ooh. Hard to tell what was real and what wasn't. Scary. That's a Throgmorton! What? Don't even... Oh no, is that Francis then? There weren't exactly that many Throgmortons around. More? Oh. Uh, whoa. I don't know what this one is. It doesn't have legs, it has, like, limb. What's this one, then? Oh, this is a Cthulhu church. Oh, God. Yeah, gotta be a little bit careful about my state of mind, too. We can't look at too much of this in rapid succession. So, this culty church... Brutus was supposed to meet them. But nobody's here. It seems pretty broken down to me. By the way, did we ever get another point? I did. War veteran. I want something to improve my shotgun. Oh, it's here, so I gotta get this one first. Sure. Oh, hello! Not wasting a shotgun bullet for you. I can get you. For the first time, I feel like we should have taken more antipsychotics before coming here. What's that that I can't pick up? Metal scraps? Oh, I don't have any rags. The bombs and stuff are actually pretty good. I like them. Okay, there's a dead person there. But before we look at that, I heard something, definitely. Dropped note. Our devoted members in the police department attracted two more officers to our ranks. We must prepare them for a meeting with our feckin' mother, the great daughter of the Lord of the Woods. 
Who is the Lord of the Woods? Oh, that's outside. Ah, oh, now that's a familiar smell. Like you're dead skunk. It smells too. Well, this is all very church-like. I mean, don't you find this at your local church? Priest's Diary. I burned the seductive witch, my daughter, my cursed seed. But she came back. How long will the Almighty test my faith? She is here, laughing at my weakness. Her body is not hers anymore. It is the filthy goat's womb, the breeder of the devil's spawn. She is mine, my blood, my treasure. Now neither the devil nor filthy men may touch her, for I have smitten her sinful flesh, mixed her beauty with dust. How could it be? How? She came back, born by the sinful hole her body turned to. She whispers to me, promising we'll be together, always. They hanged me, their father, but not for long. That night I was born again, by my dear daughter. Oh, what the heck is going on here? The feckin' mother? Something's chewed this one up real bad. Does that key open this door? <sighs> the door won't budge. It goes downstairs. Do I want to go? The spacesuits. Are we diving again? Oh! Oh, we are! <gasps> That's exciting! I almost forgot that was a thing since we haven't done it for so long. Let's finish looking around at the church first, especially because it seems like there's something outside. Is this it? There is an upstairs. Oh, I know it. I know it. Is that what the Dagon looks like? I remember seeing one in the Witcher series before, but it didn't really look like that, did it? I don't think so. That seems to be it for now. It's outside. You cannot build here! It's cursed! Cursed! The sky smote the carpenters for their sins. You cannot build a church in this place. Good. Let this oh. place be our legacy. May the horror that befell the carpenters be forgotten, and hope take its place. Esse quam videri. This is not related to the main case. This is the historical heritage thing. I think. Oh, where are the other ones? Inside? No, it's way on the other side. Outside. Yeah, you can tell because usually the crime scenes aren't this big. But the gigantic ones seem to be related to the um, historical heritages. Make it quick, Reverend, I implore you. I lost everything to this fire. My house, my family. No need to recite every single bloody name. Let's get a handle on what actually happened here. Well, they built a cemetery here. And then... <laughs> The church building. Mm. Well, they didn't start building it here just yet. They're leaving here. I don't think this is right. You cannot build here. It's cursed. Cursed. Good. Let this place be our legacy. May the horror that befell the carpenters be forgotten. And hope take its place. Essay. Quam videri. Make it quick, Reverend, I implore you. I lost everything to this fire. My house, my family. Same guy. No need to recite every single bloody name. 
The old Carpenter Manor stood here centuries ago, oh. until a fire destroyed it and killed most of the family. The church was built over the ruin. Oh. A little bit of history behind Oakmont. Which is nice, because you get 184 XP out of it. And we only need a thousand for one level, so it's pretty important. Okay, it looks like we're going diving again, people. Ah, this is in good shape and ready to use. Yeah? Ah, this is in good shape and ready to use. What? I wanted to dive! Oh, I'm so... <gasps> I'm so disappointed! I thought we could dive again. No? When are we gonna get to do that? I don't know. <laughs> Will we ever? We've been on land for so long, I completely forgot that was a thing. Well, we're still missing something here, right? We haven't found the main thing yet. Oh! After touching the diving suit, this was available. Make sure you get every scrap. We don't want anyone reading these while we're down there. Take them to the crematorium. We'll destroy them before we dive. Don't wait. I'll catch up to you. Oh, they're all diving. Maybe we are diving after all. Nope. Where did I miss something? Dude, there's freaking wild beasts in the vision. <laughs> uh, it's not letting me do the numbering. Am I still missing something here? Yes. The stars are aligned, and a new turn of the cycle begins. The time has come to return to the mother's womb, and we shall be reborn, brothers and sisters. Let's get a hand. The stars are aligned, <laughs> and a they're, new they're not turn wearing of the, the suit here begins. yet. The time has come to return to the mother's womb, and we shall be reborn. Very simple, right? Make sure you get every scrap. We don't want anyone reading these while we're down there. Now they're all Take getting dressed the here. We'll don't wait. I'll catch up to you. A group of fanatics based in the Redemption Church got rid of several bodies, took all the documents they could, and dived. Let's go! No? Church records are taken away. All records were removed because there were details of crimes in there. It's a cult, not a church. The cultists hid under the church. They must have some kind of hideout there. We might not be very welcome, huh? Churchgoers wanted Brutus to be cremated. <laughs> Throw me a bone! It's a cult, not a church, plus churchgoers wanted Brutus to be cremated. The answers are underwater. The records taken by the cultists are my only hope of discovering who betrayed Brutus. Nope. These two are... no good. Yes! 